In OBD file settings, the user has two options for specifying the type of run he wants to perform. With setting one, the bridge project folder is saved in the OBD database. And with this option, after, the user can choose between one BIM workflow and one standalone workflow. But all the bridge project information will be saved in the OBDX file. With the setting two, the user has the possibility to save the RM bridge project in one external folder. With this option, the user can run in batch mode two. So with setting two, the user can create one shortcut for RM Bridge and enter automatically in the program model with a double click. The user needs to have OBD open at the same time for licensing purpose. So let's see the next short video. So in OBD file settings, the user can choose setting two and save the option. So with a double click on the shortcut, it jumps directly into RM Bridge. And in file open RM bridge project, the user can open the bridge model or create a new one and continue his work. So this is the model that we are going to talk about. So one question from our user about this subject. So how can I run VET files in OBD? So as we saw before, the user needs to save the option setting two, and after it can run RM Bridge in a complete standalone program version. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and share it with others. If you want to see more like it, please consider subscribing to this and Bentley's other channels. Thank you, and see you next time.